Hello everybody, it's Christina. I'm doing more mail art. Okay, so my last video was um, these envelopes that I did and um, I was reading uh, a comment. Someone left a comment on this envelope. Well, not really on this envelope, but sort of about um, putting these through the mail and it might be more expensive and I can't remember what else she wrote, which got me to thinking why only make them for, I mean, I'm in that swap and it is for mailing, but let's just say it's somebody's birthday and you're going to hand deliver a card or um, you're doing a swap or you're doing a rack. And of course, we always um, give cards in the swaps and the racks. So why not make a really pretty envelope rather than let's just say, for instance, I want to give this card to somebody and I don't want to put it just in a plain white envelope. Why not put it in a pretty envelope? So I've done the same thing with this envelope. I just took random, three random colors, um, wiped them on my mat, sprayed some, um, took my mister, sprayed some water, and smooshed it, dried it with my heat gun. And I like that, I don't mind at all that it's not all covered because once I take my ink, and do this. Looks so cool. And I like using this color here, Wild Honey. Nice. Oh yeah. It's so pretty. So all those white pieces now. It's beautiful. What was this called? Wild Honey. Mm -mm. You know what's another favorite color of mine is brush corduroy. See, look how pretty that turns out. Now I'm going to take this tag, which I have coffee stained, and after I coffee stained it, it um, I like to put sometimes I like to put cinnamon on them. So it smells wonderful. This tag smells like coffee and cinnamon. Then I ink the edges with Wild Honey and Vintage Photo. And then I have this stamp set by Hot Off the Press and it's called Ticket. And I'm going to stamp that right on my tag. Then, then I'm going to do the, take the one here just for you, or let's say you could put the person's name right in here, right? You could write the person's name in there, but I'm going to stamp just for you. Then... I have this beautiful lace here. I love the color. It might look very orangey on the camera, but it's, well, yeah, I guess it's orangey. And I'm going to cut a piece off. And then I'm going to hot glue it just on the bottom. Yeah. All right, so I have some of this trim here, so I put it on the top of my tag. And let's see what else. Oh, yeah, and then I have flatback pearls. Janet, um, she's ja she's Nana JL54. We did a swap, and um, she asked me what I wanted, and I told her I didn't have any flatback pearls, so look what I got, and I'm going to use some, and I think this would look really nice. Thank you, Janet. I think that looked really nice right there. And I'm going to hot glue this at the right. If you hear noise in the background, that's because Hubby's watching TV. Okay, so there we go. From 
that to that. Isn't that cool? I just love how the inks all blend together. So then you take your card that you've made, tuck it in here, tuck it in your envelope, and then put it in your protector, your plastic protector. And then when you have your box of goodies ready to send out, you just lay this on your box and oh, your recipient will just be thrilled. Isn't that pretty? Okay, um, just had to share that with everybody. Yeah, I think I'm on a uh, mail art envelope thing right now because it's so quick, it's so easy, and it's so beautiful. So, you never know, girls, you might get one of these in the mail from me. Okay, bye-bye, everybody.